and welcome back to my channel it's been a while since i last uploaded but here is my vlog from our trip to stavanger back in june we visited the famous Chirag Bolton Rock, which is a boulder wedged in between the mountain's crevices and a, a 984 meter drop into the fjord below. <laughs> this was definitely the scariest trip of my life. It was beautiful, absolutely amazing. Nevertheless, it was terrifying and very demanding in terms of like, the actual hike itself but this is our road trip and I hope you enjoy so we stayed at this amazing Airbnb um, not far from Stavanger in a place called Hull and it was beautiful we got there in the evening the sun sets around midnight, so we got a beautiful sunset sky. And in the evening, we had a projector screen, which was amazing. Uh, we were very lucky to have found this place. So we set off in the, well, I want to say morning, but it definitely was not morning. It was lunchtime, which was way too late um, for the hike. We got there at 4 p.m. And we were told when we got there that there was a massive thunderstorm coming. So we couldn't do the hike that day. So we drove all the way back, which is four hours back. But the day wasn't ruined because it was still warm and we did manage to find a beautiful fjord to swim in. So that was the rest of our day. When we got back, we made some dinner, got some vegan good good. And he actually had a jacuzzi which was heated by firewood, which was really, really cool. I drowned twice in this pool, <laughs> but it was a really nice evening. And then we set off early the next morning to finally do this hike. We were determined, especially because we had to drive back home that night. <laughs> So the hike is six hours in total, so three hours there, three hours back. Um, you have to climb up and down three mountains to get to the boulder, so it was really challenging both on the way there and the way back. And also there was such like, a cool mix of terrain when we got there, there was, um, we were walking on rock and then we were walking on snow and then ice and it was really cool, there's me almost falling. <laughs> but it felt like we were on the moon at some point. It was insane. Dab, uh, dab, dab. Never dab. Never dab. Shut I've got up. A tiny one. No. A tree, so. What's wrong with you? Yeah, you like. I've got a tiny one. <laughs> <laughs> I missed it. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> My mum does you like things. Like we had to make many stops because this hike was so hard. It was the most difficult hike or physically challenging thing I've ever done in my life. <laughs> Those chains were to help pull us up and abseil down. Like, it was insane. I've never been so challenged in my life. I thought I was going to die. And also, it was so hot. The sun was frying us. So, we had to stop a lot of the time to, like, dunk our head in the water. We fill our bottles. That's really realizing how burnt I am. And finally, we made it to the rock with this insane drop and beautiful waterfall. The rock was just staring at us behind. It was very hard to relax. But this is the moment of me stepping onto the rock. Definitely the most amazing feeling ever. My legs were shaking. I was dancing with death, basically. But I would definitely recommend this, doing this, just for that feeling of standing on that rock. 
under that massive drop, it was it's unbelievable. Definitely take your time if you're gonna do this this hike and this rock. It, you have to do it properly. You know, some people crawl onto the rock, some people step onto the rock, some people will just go there to see it. But honestly, if you're there, just trust yourself and just do it because it's it's an unbelievable experience. Thank you so much for watching. I hope it's a quite more video soon. I hope you enjoyed. I'm missing Norway so much. So yeah, like and subscribe. See you soon.